An Ypsilanti crematory under investigation, and now the state is revealing new information about the bodies and remains that were inside. Many family members who reached out to Help Me Hank are now finally getting some closure as this case moves forward. Consumer investigator Hank Winchester reports from New Center. We're here at the Attorney General's Detroit office, and while the investigation into the crematory has been moving forward, the short-term focus has been making sure that family members are able to get the remains of their loved ones. The allegations of what was happening here inside Tri-County Cremation Services downright disturbing. Bodies allegedly everywhere, bodily fluids on the floor. It's why state investigators and the attorney general moved in, closing this place down. We were just, you know, in a process of healing as a family and just to have all of this come back is devastating. But the closure causing stress for some family members who reached out to help me Hank. Why? Because they were unable to locate their loved ones. This has been emotionally devastating. Um... We feel numb right now because we just absolutely don't know what to do. But now new information just released from the attorney general and state investigators confirms that all of the bodies have now been either cremated or removed from Tri-County Cremation Services. Those connected to this facility now under investigation. The state saying in part, Laura and the Department of Attorney General are grateful for the prompt and efficient assistance of those organizations and individuals in authorizing, overseeing, and achieving the final disposition of so many loved ones. And the investigation does move forward right now. It is a very active investigation. In fact, state investigators want to hear from any family members directly impacted by this tragic situation. We're here in Detroit. Hank Winchester. Help me, Hank.